Hey everybody, hopefully you're having an awesome day today. Welcome back to my channel. This is Wired Dog Sec back with you with another video. Before we get into it, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, comment below your thoughts and opinions in the video. You know how it goes. All right, let's dig into it here. This website here is called the Vone Hub. Basically, this is a website that has lots of virtual machines that are made vulnerable for you to conduct security testing. In other words, these machines, you can go into this website here, download these machines, and then practice your penetration testing or web testing skills. So you can build up that skill set and maybe even add some of the stuff to your resume or your portfolio. Let's do a little navigating here. Help section and then the difficulty ranges as well, as you can see here. What you find hard, other people may find easy and vice versa. It all depends on your background experience. What have you been exposed to previously? This defines your current skill level. And that is absolutely correct. Some things may be hard for you, easy for others, and vice versa. And as it explains here, this is these are basically practice machines to help expand your skill set and improve your skill set. It helps out with various different things in cybersecurity. As it mentions here, you need to be able to solve problems. That's what cybersecurity is about, providing value to the business. The, the business has problems. You got all these cyber criminals, bad guys trying to hack into the organization to get access to valuable data, and they need to have that issue or problem solved. So that's why they bring you guys into the environment, cybersecurity professionals, to help secure the environment to prevent such attacks from happening, or if the attacks do happen, to help contain the incident and minimize as much damage as possible. So you're very easy. It says brute force, no information needed to gather. Uh, be able to guess about the target, single vector, single injection, other things here. Then it goes to easy, medium, hard. And then I guess if you really want to test out your skill set, you can go to the very hard. Or if you just like pain, you can go to the very hard section here and try those machines out. If you're new to it, I, re I recommend starting from, you know, very easy and then gradually moving up, you know, maybe do one machine a week or so. So you can get into the group of things, make sure you get the process down, the procedures down, make sure you're actually understanding the tools and you're understanding the attacks that are, that you're conducting against the machines. Make sure you're understanding the concepts of what you're doing. So you don't just want to go through and just blindly do things and you don't understand what you're doing and then what are you learning in return nothing so you got to make sure you're actually understanding what you're actually doing if, if that's making any sense let's see here resources right it just goes over a few other things here it's, looks like some other websites get be potentially helpful to you guys. Metasploit Unleashed, Open Security Training Suite. So some other resources you can go in here and check out that can help you along the way as you're hacking these virtual machines. As I said, this will help expand your skill set and something you can put on your resume. Say, hey, you know, I might be new to the cybersecurity industry or I want to maybe I want to break into pen testing or something like that. Well, you know, maybe I don't have the hands-on experience in a corporate or enterprise level environment, but I have experience from Bone Hub or similar testing websites. And you can tell that to the interviewer and maybe they'll take a chance on you or they'll be more likely to take a chance on you. Say, hey, you know, this person's actually taking the initiative, going out of their way to hack these other practice machines, what have you, in order to build their skill set. I, I can see that this person really wants to get into this industry. So, hey, you know, let's maybe take a chance on this guy and let's build them up. Let's mentor them the right way and they can become something great. But if you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, comment below on your thoughts and opinions. I'll have the link to this website posted in the description section of the video. And thank you for watching.